we gonna flush out a lot of things because you know I heard I heard you say certain things which you know is true to to how you were living at the time and your mindset, but like people don't understand because we not from that exactly. So like, okay, why do you feel like you had to turn to the streets? Look, I'm all, I'm been around shit my whole life. Like, time I, since I can remember, I'm probably like probably four or five uncles in the kitchen cooking crack, and I asked what that is. Like a circle, and they say, four or five. Yeah, about five. How old am I? Like five, nigga, I'm just saying, well, nigga, you were below right, ten around, around that time. Like five, six, three, four, five, six, right around that time. And I was like, what that is? A circle of crack. And they were like, oh, it's a grown up cookie. You feel me? I've like, been around this shit. My uncle got man, been around. It. Like you feel me? It just so it always been in me. Like you feel me? My mama, like street. My mama the real street. My daddy was serving. Like I'm always plug up, pull up to the house. You feel me? I used to be, you feel me? I done been. So I always knew what the fuck was going on. I just been in it. But like, for me, like, just stepping in it, like, is when my mama first, came, like, not first came home for prison. But when I'm, like, starting to get older to realize, like, we really struggling. You feel me? Well, how do you know y'all really struggling? Just like, sure. Because I'm getting older now. And I'm going to, you feel me? This, like, when, when nigga getting older, then you see other kids with certain shit. Then you, you feel me? Like, and it ain't like how it used to be. Like, before she went to prison, it was straight. I told you she was in the streets, you feel me? But then when she came home, it was like, you feel me? It wasn't all the way. Like, she came home 13, turned 14. It was straight. We were living with my auntie. Then we moved. Like, I slept on the floor like three years straight. Like, I ain't. That's why I don't give a fuck. I never have a bed. I don't got to have a bed right and now. And how old? You sleeping on the floor? On the floor. Three years straight. Uh, how old are you at this one? Probably like 14 or 17. Is it you? You go to school? Yeah. I am tell you, I'm is not it fuck, really. Is it fucking with you because you go to school and like you probably? I don't know. You know, again, I don't know, I don't know how you like the, the neighborhood, how you kind of grow up. But like, you probably go to school and realize, man, a lot of them other people ain't sleeping on the floor. Like, nah, it was, it was regular. Like, it was just what it is, what it was. I mean, like, I don't want no crying that, like, no cry baby. Like, it just is what it was. But then I realized, like, and I'm, and I know my mama can't get me if I like. She can't, she ain't in this position. Like, you feel me? She ain't even got a thousand dollars on name, five hundred dollars on name. Like, literally, you feel me? So I start like trying, just doing little shit, doing little shit. Like, I'm skipping school, doing little shit. Like, you feel me? I just, then that shit end up coming. Like, then, it, then that shit end up becoming like down there, like a, a routine. Like every like, that's all the nigga mind was on. Like, bad. I'm in school looking up shit. Like, how do you feel me? Yeah, like shit it became like a habit. So you, you, you're trying to make an income Because yeah. like you, you see You see a family struggling And you're like yo Man I gotta get to some shit quick Because like man This shit ain't it mm, Exactly So you in school and like You just trying it. to figure some shit out Yeah man I ain't yeah, And I ain't doing it with like No bad intentions Like I, I get old, As I start getting older Then I realize like I was just taking from people like you feel me. I probably don't fuck them, put somebody else in the bag. You feel me? Yeah. That ain't you feel me. That karma bad. That type of karma be bad when you taking from people like, especially them type of people, innocent, good people. And I think that's where you know. So you did an interview, and this is what really dawned on me. I was like, man, they caught him early because. I don't think he knows how to express his past exactly. without sounding like exactly. I he's a heartless think. nigga. Yeah, man. I don't know. I so you, you you're, you're telling the truth. You're yeah. telling the truth, but nobody's thinking about Nardo back then sleeping exactly. on the floor. Talking about, I talking about, I see people in the comments talking about if you keep it up. What the fuck you mean keep it up, nigga? I, ain't got, I don't do that. That shit. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, so 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 and and we'll get we'll get this out the way off top. So. For the people who watching, like, you know, and, and I seen the interview. And by the way, salute to the guys over a Big Facts, you know what I mean? Yeah, for sure. They asked you about, like, you know, like, maybe what jobs you had. And you were like, well, you know, I was kind of, like, robbing people. Mm -hmm. And people thought a few things. They, they said, well, it's not like he glorifying it, yeah. right? Because I think you're like, well, why do that if, you know what I mean, I could get the same shit? And I'm saying how my mind was 16, 15, you feel me? Yeah, so, but, and, and that was your mindset then. You're sleeping on the ground. You don't really know much. You're trying to help your family. Your mother is in a situation where she can't really provide like she used to provide. And you got to deal with all this, right? Mm -hmm. So all of that's happening, right? When do you kind of figure out like, man, th this probably ain't going to be the way 
Uh, I ain't never really like when I started rapping like seriously, like cause I made my first song at seventeen, but even then it's still like little shit. I think even besides doing now, you feel me, nigga? Like when like time passes, you get into other type of shit. So you feel me? So other type of shit be going on. So I started rapping. Boom. Seventeen, I dro- I made my first song. I ain't even like this shit. I made my first song, then I just kept going to the studio. Wow. Why I kept going? Yeah, because like I mean, cause look, when I made my first song, I ain't like that shit. Like, but I knew why I ain't like it, cause I, the way I was rapping on it, like I ain't my, my delivery, like I was I'm, rapping. I'm, I'm asking you why you go to the studio, because like you know, clearly you in the streets at this point. You're trying to get it how you could get it. Like, oh, you saying we, what just made me? Yeah, yeah. Did, 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 did you think like, yo, I can't keep doing this? I got to figure out some other shit. Nah, listen. Even when I was doing it, I knew I wanted to rap. Like I knew I wanted to rap since I was 14. Mm. But I just ain't never had a time, you feel me, or the funds. So I just was doing what I was doing till I could get the time and the funds. And then, and I felt like I was too young. Like, nigga, not finna drop no song 14. You feel me? So I just, I just was waiting, like, getting better, but trying to perfect my craft in the midst of doing all this shit. You feel me? And then, as a nigga, like, you gotta think, I'm 14, so I don't wanna rap. By the time I'm 17, nigga, I'm dead and been through a whole life type of other shit. So it's like, it's even more shit to rap about. You feel me? Are like again, it, it, it maybe just because I'm an outsider, but I'm still thinking, though, you in Jacksonville, yeah. Some of the stuff that you probably do in the streets, is some of the stuff catching up with you now. You you, you kind of trying yeah, to change lanes a little bit, but like from what I hear, like when you do some dirt in the streets, so it's always yeah, a little. Yeah, you said caught it. Yeah, yeah, man. But that is what it is. Ain't never nigga ain't never gonna pout about it. It is what it is. Shit happened. Feel me? 